Now, according to a Financial Times report, OpenAI is all set to produce its first AI chip in partnership with U.S. semiconductor giant Broadcom. The chip is expected to go into production next year and will be used internally rather than being made available for external customers. Now, OpenAI's ChatGPT is among the world's leading AI chatbots with nearly 800 million people using it every week. It currently holds around 60% share of the AI chatbot market, but keeping such systems running takes enormous computation power both for training the models and also operating them at scale. Now, to keep pace, OpenAI is exploring the idea of designing its own AI chips, which will help the company reduce reliance on outside suppliers and to cut costs. Last year, Reuters had reported that OpenAI was working with Broadcom and Taiwan Semiconductor Manufacturing Company, or the TSMC, to develop its first in-house chip. At the same time, the company was also using AMD and NVIDIA chips to keep up with the demand. Then in February this year, new reports suggested that OpenAI was preparing to cut its reliance on NVIDIA but developing its own AI chips. And sources told Reuters that the ChatGPT maker was finalizing the design on its first in-house chip with plans to send it to TSMC for fabrication within months. On Thursday, Broadcom's CEO said that the company expects its AI revenue growth in fiscal 2026 to improve significantly after securing more than $10 billion in AI infrastructure orders from a new unmanned customer. Now, OpenAI's move follows similar efforts by Google, Amazon and Meta, which have developed custom chips to handle AI workloads amidst surging demand for computing power to train and run AI models. For all the latest news, download the Vion app and subscribe to our YouTube channel.